Get out the fucking way. What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work? This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So, what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The He's truth. A... Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, but some people. <laughs> They no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you married Michael. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Yeah. By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier, he's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. And he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down and get the files back. A man, what's a pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right! You make me want a lobotomy. Hey, let's stay in touch on the headsets. Observatory yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there to that guy's house. Understood. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that you might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? We weren't casing the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job. 
So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him. But it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? The fuck? I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out! Shoot! T, if you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet! I don't see nothing yet. There it is. I'll pass downtown. Jet's moving. Gotta give a lead.
How'd it go? Oh, fine. Just fine. I got the files. I'll take them to Madrezzo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works, a little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor! Trevor! Ah, I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that. Where is he? Uh, the fuck has happened? Why did he have his car? Man, that piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What? Happen, cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Trevor! don't. That's your fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, shit. The fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Oh, now, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while oh. while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you pop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called Shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can... Hang out, you know, it's a 
A very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Alright, man, you cool. Try and keep up, little homie. Hey, Molly. I'm outside the studio. All right. Go over the wall and find the car on the lot. And then what? Only the principal actors and stunt people are authorized to go near it. So, you could get in wardrobe and play the part or try something else. All right. When you're out of there and clear of studio security, call me. They need you on set. Where the hell is Brandon? Jesus, are you gonna find him? Someone's gonna find him. I've gotta get hey, some control of this set. Get him out of here. You hit them! Oh, you This 
this an abduction? Nah, you cool? No, I'm not cool. Not at all. I mean, chill out. I'm just interested in the whip. What's this? Spikes? What do you mean, the whip? I could buy the... Oh, see you later. I could buy this car with what I make in the morning. I think you underestimating the value of this automobile. I over... God, shit, man, he ain't coming back. I overestimating your own talent. Uh, I think you're underestimating what I get paid. You get paid a couple million for a morning's work? Shit, I should sack my agent. Yeah, shit. Stockholm Syndrome won't work on me, fuckball. Look, I respect you as an artist and a human being, but I got other priorities. Damn, what's this button do? <laughs> If you have the car, bring it to Hayes Auto in South LS. Mr. Weston is marathon training, but he can reconfigure his route to meet you there. All right, cool. I got the car. No drama. That's good. The studio is enough of a money sink without the costs that that drama can bring. What kind of shape is the car in? We plan on refitting the guns to take live ammunition. Do the traffic spikes and ejector seat need replacing, too? Uh, both of those are going to need replacing, all right? Good. One more thing. Mr. Weston's security detail are concerned about a suspicious figure near the garage. Let us know if you see something. developing quite the rep there, Slick. Insurance companies hate these kinds of claims. They don't like cats with the inside edge shorting them either. So how'd it go? Smooth enough, you know. Movie people. You know what the irony is? I'm a major shareholder in that same studio, so what we just did is practically legal. Ha! Practically. Oh shit! Look at this motherfucker. You doing it big, my nigga, on the set. Lamar, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, chirped your boy Trevor. It's fucked up when you gotta get your GPS location on your homeboys through a motherfucking speed freak. True that. Devin Weston, master of the two-hour female orgasm. What it is, Holmes? Lamar Davies. He was just leaving. Hey, not on my account. You looking for gainful employment, homie? Hell yeah, I'm always trying to get some motherfucking paper. Just the type of guy I like to work with. Predictable. Hey, we could bring your boy here in on the last part of the shipment. Oh, yeah, nigga, that's exactly what you could do. That's exactly Hell what you yeah. could do right man, there, exactly. man. Exactly. If you want him in, then you get him to boost the rest of the shit you got. Oh. Give me my money and I can go on oh, with my motherfucking oh. life. Oh, no, am I sensing tension here, Slick? <gasps> He's the spirit, but you're the brains. Am I wrong? I can see it. Look, I need you on point when we move this stuff out of town. Yeah, whatever, man. Call me when it's done. And after this, make sure we got our motherfucking check, all right? Ciao, baby. It is what it is. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, come here. I'm gonna put you in touch with my legal counsel. Hey, hey, don't touch me, homie. I don't get down like that. Yeah, let me tell you how the world works, Slim. You got off lucky, homie.
only inches. Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Ah, oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Ah, uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Coming, Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! <clears throat> Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> uh, listen, I'm beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And I, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Meriwether. Mm, those assholes Big again. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition it. Fantastic! Let's go! Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go! The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip, but... Great! Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I... Uh, well... Okay, well, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit! Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merriweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I got it. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultants fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. Just the plane I need to take on a heavily armed, tax-funded militia. I'll get you on the radio! Trouble. The Mary was 
under the radar. Air traffic's being monitored from the military base. You got to defend, man. The military will be all over you. You got bad information, brother. I'm fine. Got a drop, man. They're on their screens. I'm in control of this. I got the cargo plane right ahead of me. They're gonna use those weapons for no good, T. They'll be better in our hands. I know it isn't my place to ask, but how exactly do you plan on requisitioning this equipment so you've caught up to them? Whoa! One step at a time, Ronald! Let's just get there first! We're approaching Fort Zancudo, Trevor. It's vital you don't fly right over it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, the cargo plane's got four jets, a 200-foot wingspan. Yeah, 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 and I'm in a crop duster. This is something I'm acutely aware of. Enough! Captain T in a 1989 crop duster. Just enjoying the beautiful San Andreas weather. Unidentified aircraft, divert your course or we will be forced to shoot you down. Really? Shoot me down? Well, that seems a little extreme, doesn't it?
cockpit! How is the man supposed to enjoy his beer and peanuts with all these pumps? Meriwether Cargo Jet Ground Control, please be advised of a change of destination. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field! Swapping radio channels. Over. Run! Run, you there! I got the jet! You with the buyers? Welcoming parties here, Trevor! Fly safe now! Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God! The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea! But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? 
An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. Smell any funny spices? Я ничего не вижу, бот. Эй, передави документы. What? Паспорт давай, ебать, мам. I don't fucking understand you. А, да ты по-английски не шаришь. Что за хуйня с тобой? Я говорю, паспорт покажи. Все вы нелегалы, как один. И по гражданским арестам, ты понял? Америка страна возможностей, а я воспользуюсь возможностью послать тебя обратно через границу, откуда ты приперся. What? <laughs> Very good, Joseph. Real fine. We'll make a civilian protector of our nation's borders from undesirable elements of you yet. Sorry, citizen, just a training exercise. Ah, okay. Well, I'm so glad that you patriots are out here defending this fine American desert sand. Well, thank you. When you could be in town fucking some girls and further destroying the gene pool. Hey, there's a real problem here. Да, люди мотивированы необходимостью прокормить свои семьи. Едут сюда работать по черному за копейки и прут, прут в эту страну. It's a disaster. And that's why we form the Civil Border Patrol. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. My Patriot meter's going off. Huh? <laughs> uh. Come on, both of you. We've got some illegals over them hills. Uh. Come on, come on, you drive. Uh, you drive, let's go. Drop, get in the back. Meshkin often. What's your name, citizen? I'm Joe, that there's Joseph. Trevor. Okay, Trevor. Well, it's saying we need to head for the Yellow Jack Inn. Oh, good. They love me in there. Well, I'm definitely getting a strong reading. The Patriot Meter predicts undesirables with up to 79% accuracy. <laughs> Surely this is a sick joke. I mean, I love hanging with freaks, but you two losers cannot be for real. Unfortunately, this is as real as it gets. These people are criminals who threaten our way of life and drive down our property prices. Они думают, что могут приехать сюда в поисках лучшей жизни для себя и своей семьи. Это противоречит Конституции. Come one, come all, I say. This country's got bigger problems to deal with. <laughs> well, that's because you've been brainwashed by the secular media. Don't you worry, though. We'll convert you. My brother showed some, uh, well, let's just call it sexual weakness in his younger days. Well, they must be inside. Go see if you can flush them out, Trevor. Is there any yeah, place you know. in the I'm world I'd rather be? You know? Hey, you're banned. You Oh, this is pointless. Everyone in here has done something illegal. Warren and Moody, they always make interesting movies. Hey, Trevor, get out here now! They're in that car, let's go! Go, go! Let's bring him in, boys. Here, take the stun gun. Really? Nobody needs to die here. We're civilized people. Can you believe they're singing? It's like they don't even care! Go subdue those illegals, Trevor. I want to see how you handle that stun gun. Who are you guys? <laughs> Sorry about that. And pal, 